Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? Remember, anytime you work on your appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there is no chance of electrocution. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the compressor start device in a generic refrigerator. It's going to be a very easy repair, should only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. For this job, we're going to need a quarter inch nut driver, a flat blade screwdriver, and a pair of needle nose pliers. When you open up the package, you're going to get a new compressor start device and a run capacitor. The compressor start device provides power to the compressor start and run windings. So if your refrigerator stops cooling and you can hear a click coming from the back every few minutes, it's most likely time for a new compressor start device. Let's begin with removing the rear cover panel. Using the quarter inch nut driver, take out the screws holding the panel. Slide the power cord off the cover panel and pull it out. Here we can see the start device mounted on the side of the compressor. Use needle nose pliers to remove the bail strap. Next, use a flat blade screwdriver to carefully pry the start device off the compressor. Open the tab and remove the wire plug. This is the old compressor start device with the run capacitor next to the new one. If you don't have this part, you can get it from AppliancePartsPros.com. We need to slide on the capacitor. Make sure these terminals plug into these slots. Connect the wire plug. Now push the start device onto the compressor terminals. Install the bail strap to secure the start device in place. Check if the rear cover panel is clean from dirt and dust. Wash it with soap and water if needed. Install the rear cover panel to the refrigerator and secure it with the screws. And now, when we're done with the repair, plug the fridge back in and make sure it's cooling down. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please check out our other repair videos available on our site, on Facebook, and on YouTube.